something different but more of the same I don't see a barrel just on I was following too closely turn on the jets yeah we'll get a lot down here over real quick if you're enjoying this content please consider subscribing hit the like button hit the share button it helps get the word out on this channel and also helps me know that you guys are digging what i'm putting out all right people something different but more of the same this time we're sticking close very close to home uh, we're going to our local mountain bike trails here but we decided to switch it up and just camp for the night we got a we got a driver there heading on our local trail day one we're gonna do two days of trails here so we're gonna go see what we can see for about an hour hour and a half and then we'll come back but anyway so yeah we'll see you on the trail i don't see a barrel just on here it might be up by your handlebars oh. let's look and see yeah there it's, it is because where's your shifter this thing okay and let's try you that. can try it while you're riding too Let's do this. Shifter is slow to roll into the hot gears, so it's kind of messing things up a little bit. It's getting in the way of the fun. So this is called Sugar Bottom. I'm not sure where the name came from, but this is actually the very first trails I tried when I uh, first moved to these to these here parts. Uh, really, you know, they have from green all the way to to block trails here nice and flowy Vans killing it yeah that's a that's a long and short story oh all right I was following too closely so it's my, my bad um I need to focus I do not have my shocks open I don't think I need to right now we're just gonna climb into this low section here sticks us to the top of the ridge and we'll get some a bit of downhill downhill for these parts so these these cells that we have here a little bit more cross country -ish. different like not a whole lot of downhill so we get it downhill, but they're brief. They're very brief. <laughs> Ooh, man, you can go off that bridge so easy. <laughs> anyway, this is one of my favorite parts of the trail is the pine trees. So nice, smells good and fresh. So shocks i ride i think with the majority of with my shocks closed and then if it's open sometimes I, I can't predict or really make a good judgment of how i want to react with the reverb recall whatever you want to call it All right. i think last time we rode these trails we came down on this section if I remember correctly. We're gonna go check out this easy trail for us, for the motors. Okay. This is so you gotta be careful here because well I'm assuming if you're watching this you're probably way better than I am but then it's so easy to get off the trail here and those bombs will just break your your trajectory of, of, of riding 
You know, so you gotta be, you gotta really stick it. Whoa. Yeah, you see how it is right here? You gotta, you really gotta stay in there. Oh. And there you go. I got too excited. You know, I almost bit it. You just say I'm one of the worst mountain bikers out there, by the way. Did I, did I already mention that? I don't think I did, but if I did, haven't, now you know. I just don't know how some people descend like so fast. Obviously, years of training. Just being able to ride a bike in a straight line is not enough, I suppose. Okay, a little flowy. I forgot to switch my grips. These are my endurance grips. I rode these grips in uh, Grand Marais for the Lutzen 99er. So, so they're not the best for like technical, hey, technical sections, you know. <laughs> little jump out there and then I turn on the jets just love it <laughs> you know <laughs> it's definitely not flow trails <sighs> there we go oh there goes the chipmunk All right, I need to calm down. Write it down there. Hmm. Love this little bridge section. Oh yeah, a little. So this is really more, more cross-country mountain biking than anything. It's super aerobically demanding. I'm trying to bring you guys some of the flowy stuff that is interesting. Showcasing some of my amazing, you know, skills. Not. <laughs> oh, how do people ride that so fast? There, like, you know. I had to stop way, way down. I got my shocks wide open so I can keep all my tires on the ground. Those are kind of scary. Those like off camber uphill exposed on one side sections you know I don't like those <laughs> huh. all right kind of tight in here uber tight huh. <sighs> Rudy roots are like kind of one of my Nemesis Especially uphill roots Whew. All right, this is my favorite section of these trails here is This pine tree Situation <laughs> For lack of better words description yeah this is nice in here scenery is good smells good Vaughn's really trying to push the pest through here I think she's trying to drop me a couple years back 
we had like this weather phenomenon called the derecho that came out and did that damage that you see on these trees it was like 200 mile an hour winds inland it was insane it damaged a lot of stuff so this was years later we're still seeing the impact of that going for it going for it oh this is nice here guys this is really nice if you don't have a mountain but go get yourself one better yet go rent one I'll, I'll let you use mine but it's gonna slow you down it's pretty slow bike so go rent you one or buy one whatever you whatever it is and and see what time it is man roots are fun but also a pain <laughs> I guess it would be better if I had my shocks wide open. Let's take a look at, at the pretty lake gores. So if you see from here, right over on the other side of that beach there is where uh, our campground is going to be for the night. This place is so hard to get a hole in a spot over the summer because everybody's coming out here doing this stuff, you know, doing hashtag lake life. So, anyway, that's what, so we're able to go one night here. Yo! Oh, you gotta, can't get too reckless in those corners. Yeah, got some work to do before Leadville. Yeah, well. Still have time. You have a whole year. Oh, did we mention? Bond's going to let me. If you, if you're a frequenter of the channel, you already know it. So she's going to let me. For she was able to finish Lutzen with Habib intact. So, so she got a year to train. You had an option to do it this year or defer it to next year so she did it for next year um, that way she can really train and and get time climbing right because it's at altitude and it's very very climby to be honest so it'll be fun now definitely subscribe so that uh, you get to watch that that video when she conquers the rest against against the rest across the skies so this takes you all the way to the main road and then you have it downhill to exit the park or Dumo trails Diff and narrow, so you gotta be careful. Like right here. Definitely fun. But you don't wanna booger it. When you're doing like 20 miles an hour downhill. There'll be more downhill for us. Oh, so rooted. <laughs> Hashtag worst mountain biker ever. I'm gonna attempt to get you guys a shot of the party cove. This is the, what they call it here in Iowa, where they drop anchor. There you go. They drop anchor and just hang out right there. I don't know if you can see it from over here. But that's, that's how they do it here in the good old Midwest. 
<laughs> Look at this. I don't know what you all think. Should we pull it out? Obviously, you're not here to answer the question. <laughs> I think we'll pull it out. We don't have plug. any plugs. No, we forgot all our stuff. We, we left all our tools at home. I think it'll plug. All right, turn and try. <laughs> Definitely. Well, I guess we got a roll so that you tie can seal. Yeah, that was that was a single truck. That was definitely it. We're gonna go back, load the bikes up, and uh, head on down to the campground. How's it going, guys? Good. That's that's Leon. Hi. Hey. And that's Brian. These are local uh, gravel scouts here. Yeah. You know, how you guys doing? Good. Great. Campsite is set up. Well, the cooking comes. <laughs> is set up so I'm gonna go ahead and do that um, let me let me give you guys a let me give you guys a tour obviously quintessential you have to have this this is part of the whole process um, and a little seasoning here let's do this uh, bootleg of course they had to get you with that name <laughs> salmon seasoning this stuff is amazing and uh, lumberjack all these manly names, I suppose. Bon appétit. Good morning. Oh, man. The coffee is fantastic. Um, shout out to these folks out here. Uh, I'm going to be making some French toast, so you guys are going to come along for that uh, cooking ex episode. And then after that, we're gonna go hit the trails. Oh, we're doing a So funny thing, newbie mistake, we forgot our syrup, but luckily, if you do any gravel or mountain bike races, you've seen this out here. So this saved us. And that's uh, that's breakfast, that's the finished product. A little bit of andouille chicken sausage and uh, French toast. I forgot to cut it ahead of time. Hurry <laughs> has taught me how to enjoy pancakes. You cut it first. That's right. And then the syrup doesn't run off. But Correct. I got too excited today. <laughs> You're too hungry. <laughs> I didn't transfer the pancake eating to the French toast eating. <laughs> a quick hack that I use is I cut up the uh, French toast, the pancakes, and then put the syrup on there because that helps it get all soaked in there good. Uh, every piece will have a little bit of syrup goodness on it. First bite, no taste tastes. Oh yeah, I think it was good, right? It's delicious. Oh wow, that is fantastic. Yeah. Good morning, Grubber Gang. All right, we're jumping on this trail. I've already seen this trail, never been on it. But today, we're gonna check it out. There's a climb. <laughs> it says there's a climb here. How bad could it be? 
so so we're gonna go ride it we're gonna ride this trail and it's gonna lead us to the campground all right here we go trails are wide open today and i'm your pilot today i'm your captain today a sweet hour and a half of riding perhaps yeah and that's it that's all sure then we gotta get home there's a skills course around here let's hit it let's hit it there we go we've been trying to look for this The skinny i'm not ready for the skinny this morning i don't think we normally come this way we normally start with the easy trails down there today we feel a little bit more loose loose with the sauce so we're gonna check it out let's see what we have i've never been on this trail so i probably shouldn't be <laughs> running really fast but yolo oh narrow <laughs> this is flowy so far so good i have the shocks wide open oh back tail almost went out oh, oh. i was in the wrong gear but i'm just gonna muscle up no time to warm up i guess uh Hit the trails, just full gas. I think I'm capable of going faster if I had more skills, but I don't. <laughs> Woo. This is twisty and turny. Oh. Pedal strength. Whoa! Definitely narrow on the narrow side, man. <sighs> Definitely on the narrow side. It makes you feel like you're gonna clip your buzz when you just buy anything out uh, here. So this portion is supposed to be the high water access because well, this place floods pretty often it hasn't in the last two years i think i'll wait for yvonne here and i think we're gonna go that way i remember this i used to come back here come this way years years ago over 20 years ago and would uh right out here we are starting another set of trails here Let's see what we got so Ivan told me that when I'm behind her, then she'll kind of ride hard as soon as I pass her. She's just like, oh well, then she just slows down. So we're going to stay behind her for the most part today and see if we can push the pace a little bit. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> and the GoPro. Oh, is this thing still on? <laughs> I just beat it, guys. So, you might have seen I lost control and I went down on my right side. I couldn't unclip in time. It was a steep embankment. But, uh, slow motion. Is there a deer back there? As long as it's not a mountain lion, we're good. <laughs> I don't do mountain lions and black bears. Look at that. Look at that view. Incredible. Oh, 
that was fun. Yvonne got, Yvonne got stung right in the, in the neck. Venom right to the main line. I just love the, uh, the high speed uphill stuff. Just super high cadence. Oh, sweet, sweet view. Check out the view. I'm not gonna stop today because I stopped yesterday. Just gonna keep, keep the momentum going. I forgot to switch my, my grips. Oh, I took that a lot better. Yesterday I took it too, too narrow and uh, it was not the best. We're shredding, Van. Van fuck. Fast wheel right now. Drop back. Oh, you gotta, you gotta stop, 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 stop. Oh. <laughs> we got some hitchhikers <laughs> right to the galaxy. Out, no. Just getting more stuff. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. That was. That was. No reward after that. All the freaking climbing that we just did. <laughs> Slowly but also highly, highly. There's no room for mistakes. Or the margin of recovery is slim, should I put it that way. Let's give you a little... Oh. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Wild! So far. Oh, the trail is eroded in that section. No bueno. Ah, she got right corner here. Um, that's it. That's all she wrote for this weekend. Thank you for riding with us. Uh, until next time, we'll see you on the road. Ivan, any last words for the viewers? Get out and ride your bike. All right. You heard her. All right. Ciao.